from the west coast back to the east coast and now down south welcome to another episode of rolling with nick campus edition i'm your host nicholas ramsey and today we are at the one and the only university of georgia so now georgia is the home to the bulldogs you may know them for their football they do really good in football you may know them for their business school but uga is an absolute amazing school to further your education at so today we are going to roll around this humongous campus and we're going to see what uga has to offer and if it may be a fit just for you so strap your seat belts up because we are going to roll around so let's go ahead waste no time and let's check it out So our first stop today is going to be the Ramsey Student Center. Now behind me is the Ramsey Student Center with one of the largest recreation centers here in the United States at 440 square feet. And here we also have lecture halls, classrooms, all that good stuff can be found right here inside the Ramsey Student Center at the University of Georgia. And right down, just a few walks down, we have the Joe Frank Harris Commons, and this is right by the Recreation Center. So you can come right from the Commons, keep it pushing over to the Recreation Center. For all of my creatives like myself, here, well, I don't drop, <laughs> but this is the Lamar Dodd School of the Art behind here. This is where you'll go, I'm sure, to do all your art stuff. And then we're gonna make our way over to the Georgia Museum of the now Art. Now behind Center. me is the beautiful and the official Georgia Museum of Art. Now, it's free. The only thing is it's closed on Mondays, but who cares, right? Well, let me not say that. But anyway, y'all, so this is gonna be the area for the creatives because you have the School of Art right there, then you have the Georgia Museum of Art, and then right across we have the Hodgkin School of Music. All right, y'all, so behind me is the Hugh Hodgson School of Music. Now, their concert hall hosts a uh, hosts a wide variety of performances from ensemble performances to world-class artists, major international orchestras, all of that is going to be at the Hugh Hudson Concert Hall. And then right over here, this is literally the place for creatives, the art, music, and then we have the Performing Arts Center, the PAC. So right, right now I am in front of Four Towers, which is going to be home to the Visitor Center. Also the College of Agricultural and Environmental Sciences is right behind me. So now here you have an activity activity center, you have the Hall of Fame, the Agriculture Hall of Fame, you have the Office of Development and Alumni Relations, and then over here to my left, camera right, you have the Visitor Center. So this is where you come, you can ask questions, if you want to do a self-guided tour, they have maps on the outside, so that's going to be all located over there in the Visitor Center. And then you have the UGA Health Center, which is your one-stop shop for integrated medical, wellness, and counseling services. This health center provides so many resources to students and faculty and staff and all of that. So if you ever get the chance or if you never need anything, go ahead and why not check out University Health Center at the University of Georgia. So right here behind me, we have the Edgar Rhodes Center for Animal and Dairy Sciences. So if you love sciences with animals and dairy, this is gonna be the place just for you. So here on the East Campus, you have one, two, three, four different residence halls. We got the McWhorter Hall, you got Rooker, you got Busby, and you got Van Diver Hall. These are all the halls that's gonna be located right here on the East Campus Village, which is not actually far from over there at the Recreation Center. So you can walk right from your residence hall right to the East Campus Village, um, to the Recreation Center. <laughs> So I know you're probably asking, okay, so how am I going to get around campus? Is there transportation? Of course there is. So we have, as you can see behind me, there are some students standing at the bus stops. So they have bus shuttles for UGA students that will take you around campus where you need to be. So you just wait at those stops and then they are on they are run on a schedule and they're there to pick you up and drop you off and also if you drive they have park index conveniently located around campus you can actually download the uga app so you can see what parking is available near you and they show also the campus map whatever it is download the uga app just like i did 
All right, y'all, so this campus is literally so huge. I'm about to finish this tour driving to the destinations because it's literally, literally huge. Like I was walking a lot already. And this thing said like a 25 minute walk, but a three minute drive, I said, all right, let me hop in this car. So we're gonna go over to our next destination where it's gonna be Sanford Stadium, which is the home to exactly where UGA is plays their football. So let's go over there. Hopefully I get some parking, so let's go. So I am standing here in front of the one and the only Sanford Stadium. So this right here behind me is exactly where UGA has their home games, home to the Georgia Bulldogs. Are you rooting for the Bulldogs? This is the stadium that you go to if you want to see the UGA Bulldogs play at home. The Sanford Stadium. You know how ram this is, packed this is on game day? Like, it's crazy. The next to the stadium, we have the Tate Student Center. Now the Tate Student Center is the living room of the UGA campus, providing UGA students with meeting spaces, dining, entertainment, and much more. So you come here, mingle with your friends, and just have a good time and forget about college for a little bit. All right, to my right, y'all, is Lester Hall. Orkin, Orkin Hall. Let's see what's going on here. Sorry, y'all. This is so big. I'm tired of walking. So then you have a parking deck right here to the left and then to the right. Let's see what hall. Okay, so you have more Rooker Hall. And then you have Corel Hall. This is where the Terry College of Business is. Oh, oh, Terry College of Business. That is exactly where that's at. And then you have the Special Collections Library over here to the right. All right, y'all, so we drive in here by Broad Street. A whole bunch of restaurants are here. This is where everybody's congregating right now. Um, if you can just go, please. Oh, whoa. Yep, so you're gonna see a Target is gonna be to my hell up, Nick, you do not have the right of way. Hold the f All right, now I have the right of way. So this is, I believe, downtown Athens. You can see Classic Center is gonna be down there. Got a bus stop right there. And then to the right, we're gonna pass by it, but it's gonna be the famous Ark. The famous, it's a historical monument here at the University of Georgia. You see a lot of people just walking around and whatnot. As you can see, these are the halls. Okay, and then we're gonna come to the right. We're gonna walk, we're gonna drive, drive, drive. I'm slowing down just for y'all right now. It's the art right there. It is downtown Athens. And it's a lot of, you see Bourbon Street, Bourbon Street. <laughs> you got some, you got places to eat around here. You see everybody just walking, enjoying the day. There we go, there we go. Yep, 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 yep. Everybody's enjoying their day. Chick-fil-A to the right, College Avenue, and then to the left, you got the- So y'all, that ends my journey here in Athens, Georgia. Thank you so much for taking this ride with me, y'all. I hope I was able to answer any questions, show you what this campus looks like. It was huge, so I deeply apologize that I wasn't able to get to everything, but I hope, hope that I was able to, you know, help in some way. And if you have any questions, please y'all, make sure that you reach out to me, and I can probably answer some of them or direct you to somewhere or a resource that can. But y'all, thank you once again. I can't thank you enough. So y'all, that's a wrap for this episode. And until next time, let's see where we're going. But thank you all so much. Please make sure y'all stay safe, stay happy, stay blessed. Tell someone that you love them. And I will see you all. I'm getting nervous as fuck. I am getting so mother nervous. But now admission anyways. is absolutely free. However, you do have to pay. I mean, admission is free. I've, and after that, they have like campus maps outside if you want to do a self-go. So right now I am. Yeah, yeah.